Hey, how y'all doing? It's Marcus Willis Jr. here, UNLV wide receiver and barber. Let's check out the barber shop. Here in the Partita Football Complex, here's my barbershop. Welcome. Talk to me about the start of cutting hair here at UNLV. How did this come about? Um, so being a walk-on here uh, financially is kind of a struggle. The intuition here is kind of a struggle for myself. So I had to think of another way to kind of get a hustle here. Um, and I was cutting hair in the restrooms at the old facility. Uh, pretty much game days, game weeks, Fridays, Thursdays, cutting for about a good four hours, couple heads each time, about 25 heads. So it got me some pocket change and some pocket money. We kind of talked off camera a little bit, but how awesome is this barbershop, what Sanchez created basically for you? Uh, it was a blessing. He found out that I was cutting in a restroom. It was kind of a joke. We were laughing about it at the old facility, but then once this place had a lot of space left over, uh, what, what of a better way to create something useful, especially for a player like me who needed this uh, venue. Talk to me about an off day here. I mean, talk to me about your whole day. Right, so usually an off day for a football player would consist of homework, uh, with rest and recovery, but for myself, I'm here working in combination with the two. Uh, I'll be, about, be in about 8 a.m. or 10 a.m. On, on a slower day, um, and I leave about 3, 3 o'clock to 5 o'clock, so I get a full day shift of work. Do you feel like you have a stronger bond with the guys by them coming in here and you guys getting to know each other? Yeah, 100%. Just cutting the hair is you and the, and the, the client and it's nothing to talk about but each other. And you know, you break ice with new players. Um, maybe you won't have conversations with them outside of this room. So it gives you about 30 minutes to an hour just to conversate, learn somebody and maybe dissect them. Even with the younger guys, the freshmen and stuff, do you feel like they come out of their shell when they're in here? 100%. The freshmen love it. Uh, just coming to college and knowing you have a barbershop in your facility for them has been awesome. Um, they love coming in here. They look up to me because I'm an older guy, so they always ask questions. I, also, I often give them advice about college and what classes to take and how to go about certain things, scheduling and so forth. Coach has got some nice hair. Do you cut his hair? No, I wish to cut his hair, but <laughs> Coach Royal is probably a little too Hollywood for me right now. but. That's definitely on the menu. That's probably a goal of mine. If I get to cut his hair, then I'm probably super official. We got to get Coach in here, Coach. <laughs> coach got to give me a shot. If I get to cut his hair, I might feel complete. But does he see your hard work here? Does he notice what you're doing? Uh, I hope so. Uh, I cut a lot of the staff members as well. I cut coaches before games. Uh, I got about four regulars that are actually coaches. Uh, I cut staff EQ staff members. Uh, even, even outside of the players, uh, it's people that come in and get haircuts. So. Okay, I know you're a guy. How many times do you cut your hair? Every week? Every other day? What's, what? Uh, I'm pretty confident in wolfing my hair, so I'll probably cut my hair every two weeks. I won't get too desperate with cutting my hair, but if there is an event, I will definitely clean myself up. That's my cheat code. Have you ever thought about opening up your own shop here in Vegas? Oh, absolutely. Down the line, you know, depending on my financial statue or even if I could get a loan or two or even getting my license, I would love to do that. Well, this is awesome. Thanks so much, Marcus. Appreciate you having us. Thank you.